Today I want to share with you a minimalistic approach to the shoe choices you have to make this spring or any warm weather really. I've selected five pairs of unique comfortable shoes you can wear in rotation from casual wear to office wear and almost everything in between without having to spend time on making elaborate outfit decisions. I'm working with two eco-friendly brands Vivaya and Bella today. Everything is linked down below for you as well as discount codes you can apply site-wide for each of them. Now these are classic staple shoes you can easily consider all of these pairs as investment pieces to wear for years to come. Now first pair is the Vivaya Flat. I've worked with them before and you know when I recently asked you in a poll what is the most comfortable pair of shoes that you owned? From the given you know popular choice of course there are many more. Vivaya came first by a long shot so thank you for voting by the way. The Aria number no. 5 here is their best seller and since I didn't get them the first round well here they are. So many colors to choose from. I picked this light ivory shade because in springtime we tend to wear lighter colors. So this is your go-to pair to put on and out the door you go without thinking twice. What I like about this style is that it's very flattering to the foot. It has the pointy toe to give you that elongated legs effect but they have plenty of options for round toe and square toe if that's really what you prefer. My favorite is the almond shape, the perfect balance between flattering and comfort. The color is also intentionally picked to blend in with the legs and support the outfit. None of these shoes are here to stand out but to complete your overall appearance. And let's not forget about the convenience of wearing them with pants, skirts or dresses. And speaking of convenience, this is a very similar pair with a slight elevation. Yes, lower kitten heels are trending right now but they're very wearable. It's such an important aspect to take into consideration because I want my shoes to last from morning to night and look chic and not worry about blisters. The inside sole is made of this soft yoga mat with herbal components. I noticed it has extra arch support cushioning and the padding of course you can go without for all day support. Now this pair feels like I'm wearing socks. Easy, simple and supportive. I chose the round toe because when you have a bit of height the foot's weight tends to shift to the toe box. It feels roomy and you will pretty much forget you have them on. <laughs> the color I choose is again neutral to blend in with the skin because I see this pair as the go-to staple to match everything in the closet. No restrictions. And now we are switching to a slightly more elegant look. These kitten heels are so adorable. It's my first choice when dressing for the office for an elegant professional look. Now even if you're not trying to look proper even while smart the lower heel can pull the entire outfit together. Now I picked a black for work look but I couldn't help but opt for a bit more than the standard black. It's all in the details right? The shape is pointy with the added ivory design. I know it looks light but it's not white. It's a nice transition from the black because of the contrast that you add a dash of uniqueness and then the ivory shade is placed as a continuation of the foot for a nice flow. The bow is such a cute feminine touch which looks well made and wearable. The heel of course is the structured heel which is also popular in this season's fashion. Now it wasn't on purpose. You know making all the fashion trend videos for you I am now an amateur expert <laughs> and aware of what styles are in and out. I gravitate towards the kitten heels and find elegance in subtle design details instead of the height. Now don't get me wrong, I love the simple suede pumps but for the office it has to be under two inches to conform to the true professional standards. Now I promise you this pair will bring you guaranteed compliments. In terms of styling it's mostly black so you can wear it with any other black garments, black slacks or an A-line skirt and perhaps a white button shirt for the traditional business look. It shows you mean business on top and chic on the bottom. You can also match it with an ivory dress or pants for a lighter spring look. 
Continuing with a preppy, more polished look are the retro sneakers from Bella today. You know, the smart sneakers are part of each of our closets by now. And if you don't have a suede or leather style, well, this is the time to reconsider it. You have the comfort of the sneakers without the sporty label assigned to your outfit. You know, men wear this all day long and call it business casual. I can easily see this shoe style as the unisex take on footwear. And I must pause pause for a second to elaborate on my experience. This is not sponsored, they were kindly gifted as well for me to try. I had planned to include these shoes in a different video before I actually received them. Now the moment they arrived and I unboxed them, I was completely taken aback by them. So simply put, I haven't tried on a comfortable leather pair like this ever and i've tried some expensive luxury shoes before so many elements i like about them that i decided to make a separate video just for essentials and here it is so let's put it this way the pictures don't do them justice I highly recommend that you give them you try now one of the first features i like about them is the quality of not only the leather used but the attention to specifics and craftsmanship the stitching the smell the soft feel the shoe box is significant bigger than any regular shoes which don't squeeze my feet or toes huge plus for me I think it's one of the biggest complaints that we have that everything looks and feels so narrow which rightfully so if you want a slimming pair yes but when I think sneakers if you're like me we actually want comfortable shoes at some point to wear part-time or full-time no <laughs> How many shoes do you own that have sheepskin lining? Probably not that many. And from what I've seen, Bella includes them even in the build of their sneakers. And why this is important is because the inside of the shoe mold around your skin over time. They will fit like a glove and no one else can wear them. It's like owning custom made shoes. And that's the biggest benefit of quality shoes. Well, quality and the longevity of the shoes. The look itself stood out to me when I ordered them because of the vintage look which is popular now. The colors are neutral and can easily be matched with most of your warm toe clothes. Now this is an elevated sneaker style for when you want to run around errands and casual chic combination with kinos, jeans or cargo pants. And speaking of loafers, I have these beautiful cognac leather loafers with a metal detail. To be honest with you, when I chose this style, I had diversity in mind. I see them recommended over and over again. I also see stores have them every season. I haven't tried wearing the metal clasp before and I would have not ordered them. And I'm so glad I did. Wow. Just wow. Do you see this? Just look at how soft this is, how it bends. I didn't even know leather shoes can be so moldable. I'm used to the stiff, hard heels that you need a few weeks to break in and 10 bandages to cover the blisters. I'm just in complete disbelief. And if you think they look comfortable, they feel like a glove. Again, a wider toe box and there's no restraint or pressure on the feet. It's a big win for me. Pay attention to the tone of the metal. So regardless what brand you pick, you want to make sure that the metal accessory matches with the tone of the leather color itself. It must all be in synchrony. You see, I have the gold on top and the light brown shades. The inside out leather lining is again something I appreciate in these shoes. This is the favorite staple I see women wear time and time again. I think I just found a new favorite brand of leather shoes. Now I always look for quality brands without the huge huge markup. For a smart look, I would pair them with neutral or brown slacks, a clean button shirt, perhaps a sweater on top, and you're done. This outfit looks preppy, elegant, but without screaming for attention. It's the expensive look we talked about in the previous video. You will look put together without even trying. Now, in addition to all the suggested outfit pairings, all these shoes have things in common. They are neutral toned, comfortable for long wear, and have closed toes. Now, you can absolutely combine them and wear them interchangeably for most activities. The flats you can wear to work as well, you know, the wedges, of course, the sneakers you can wear for casual Friday, and the loafers you can wear any time of the day. That's the beauty of staples and shoes bought with intention. They are universally flattering and not restricting to one dress or one occasion. Share down below which one is your favorite pair and why.
Remember the discount codes you can apply or on anything on their site. Ladies, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like. It lets me know to make more similar content for you. If you're looking for expensive outfits explained, check out my next video. I'll see you there.